to go on Vancouver Island. These two teams all set for their 19th match of the season. McKendry. McKendry, an important part of this Atletico team as cap for the Canadian side. And a friendly against Bermuda going back a number of years, but this is a nice run for Victor Blasco and he puts one right on target. Hoping for one, or perhaps hoping to set up one. Here he goes, into the area, and he puts it over top. McNaughton wearing the captain's armband. His pass, though, a poor one. It could result in an opportunity going the other way. Here's Soto in the box. And the first save of the afternoon for Callum Irving. Now Finally, Mr. Stremcevich is ready to see this free kick, and it's a good one. Jean-Claude Lawson does well to keep that ball on his feet. Soto in the penalty area. This is dangerous, and it is in! Atletico on the board first on the road. And a much needed first goal for Mista side. And it's 1-0 Orletti. But then a straight red card shown to Ben McKendry put Ottawa down to 10 men. And that's when the goal scoring happened for Pacific. Diaz struck. Not once, not twice, but three times. A hat trick. Aparicio this time, the set piece specialist. Brings the ball in. It's a dangerous ball. And it was loose for a second in the penalty area before Dylan Pauly got his mitts on it. And a chance for Atletico Ottawa to go on the run. Here's a ball in for Wright. Wright to Soto in the penalty area. Alberto Soto looking for options. Here's Shaw. Right foot. Got a loop, so. Nice moves into the middle. Sean Young again. Blasco, left side. This is dangerous. Blasco fires. Maybe another chance here. This has got a loop to cross into the middle. Not enough on that from Sean Young. And Dylan Powley forced into action again. Part of the Vancouver Whitecaps and Portland Timbers Academy before attending Simon Fraser University, which of course plays in the NCAA. So he'll be one to watch. Here's another one. This is onside and a save for Pauly. That time, Sean Young denied. What a result this would be. Soto, ball into the box. Nobody there. Would they continue to press like we saw in the first 35 minutes of this match? Match number 73 on the season, and it's a dangerous chance for Pacific, and denied Blasco again. And again, it will be Victor Blasco. Good ball again, and McNaughton, how did he miss? McNaughton. Pacific FC crowd at Starlight, hoping and waiting for an equalizer. Ball looking to the far post, header towards the net, and Pauly, Pauly again, a big stop. Or will be another chance for Dylan Pauly to shine. Here's Bassett, blocked by the wall, doesn't get over. Another chance, rattling around right in the penalty area, and it's off target. What a chance for Sean Young. Good ball into the middle, and Pauly is able to react at the last second. That one changed directions at the very last minute. There's a sneaky play there from Hurd. His ball in front too high, and a volley that's way over top of the goal, but not out. Another ball sent back into the middle, and finally cleared away. So an Ottawa free kick, Soto standing over the ball. And he'll lift it into the penalty area right at goal. Plays to Sean Young. A ball for Dana Luke on the right side. Ball into the middle. Nobody there though and headed away. By 
the Ottawa defense. Not over though, here's Bassett. No chance to strike with the left foot at Fabrizio. Return ball. Far side, another ball into the area over top of the cage. And Joshua Hurd does well to keep the ball in play, although he costs himself a visit into the boards on the side. Another ball in, back to Hurd. His cross knocked away. And the line meet again. And now the corner from Ali Bassett is a good high ball into the middle, and McNaughton stopped, rebound. As Jordan Haynes is taken down, and another dangerous opportunity coming up for the Tridents. And they're in a hurry. Into the middle, there it is! Taryn Campbell! We are level on the island! Four back of Halifax. Is there more? Is there more? Diaz! Stops in the penalty area, resets. Diaz leaves for Bassett and a rocket way over top of the goal. Certainly this is the last play of this match. Bassett sends it in, knocked away, at least for right now. A ball comes back for Haynes into the middle. Aparicio blocked, and that is it. Full time from Vancouver Island and Dylan Pauly. An onslaught of pressure, but he does well, and he does enough to earn a point for his team.